Good day, everybody. Today we'll be having quantitative reasoning. In this section A, first let's look at the sample here. Six multiplied by three will give us eighteen, and seven multiplied by two will give us fourteen. Subtract fourteen from eighteen, and that will give me four. Now use this explanation to find the value of w x y and k now let's proceed to section b in section b first you have to look at the sample before you proceed three multiplied by two will give us six now six plus seven will give me thirteen also Use this to find the value of M, Q, D, and N. In section C, I want us to look at the samples carefully before we proceed. 4 multiplied by 4 will give you 16. 2 multiplied by 2 will give you 4. 5 multiplied by 5 will give you 25. Now, let's proceed to the next sample here. Here you are to divide. 14 divided by 2 will give you 7. 6 divided by 3 will give you 2. 12 divided by 2 will give you 6. 15 divided by 5 will give you 3. Use this to find the value of H, V, Z, and also F. Now let's proceed to section D. In section D, what you need to do is to multiply 5, multiply by 3, will give me 15, and also 4, multiplied by 2, to give me 8. You find their sum, and that will give us 23. I want us to use this working to find the value of D, B, M and G. Now let's proceed to the last section. In this last section, you are to apply two forms of what? Method. Now, 4 multiplied by 3 will give you 12 and 6 plus 6 will give us 12. Let's use this explanation to find the value of E, V, W and F. God bless you all. Oh.